Hello, my children. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> we are here to answer Molly Jane's questions about Halloween. <laughs> okay. Question number one was, what is your favorite can Halloween candy? <laughs> you can't keep doing that. I know. What is your favorite Halloween candy? <laughs> Mine's Jolly Ranchers. I like those little orange and black peanut butter kisses. Those are um, called Molly. No, those are Mary Janes. <laughs> I said Molly. Molly Jane. <laughs> they're not Molly Janes. They're Mary Janes. <laughs> Mary Janes. She loves Molly Janes. <laughs> well, of course, I love Molly Janes. Because you can only get <coughs> those. You can only get those at Halloween. Yeah. And um, of course, chocolate. <laughs> If you're dressing up for Halloween, what is it going to be? Of course not this. <laughs> um, I'm actually going to be Elizabeth um, from Pirates of the Caribbean. Jacob's going to be little Jack Sparrow. So I don't think I'm dressing up this year, but I was cat in the hat last year. A fat cat in the hat. <laughs> <laughs> do you have, number three, do you have any favorite Halloween memories? And does your family have any special Halloween traditions? <coughs> When I was little, me and Mommy painted some, um, instead of carving pumpkins, we painted the pumpkins in the jars. And it was so cool because she's really pretty when she, um, paint. I mean, her print, yes, she's pretty, but her painting is pretty. <laughs> but yeah, um. And I'm not. <laughs> I said you are. Well, those glasses are kind of freaky, but yeah, okay. We did that for a couple of years, didn't we? Well, yeah. what do we do now? We still have a tradition now. What do we do? We go down to, um, what's that? Riverdale. We go down to Riverdale. Yeah, except I can't trick or treat this year. And it's a bit, they have a big block party there every year. And it's really cool. All the adults dress up and all the houses down the whole block are all decorated. And it's really cool. Yeah, they, they go out of their way. Somebody said that they spend like $300, $400 a year just on candy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Number four, what is your favorite horror movie, Carrie? The original one, not the remake, the original one. I don't like scary movies. Except, Mamaw's favorite horror movie was The Shining, like Molly. Um, the Shining was good. I guess The Shining. Yeah, I didn't really think it was that scary. Mamaw was sitting there. I went downstairs to watch it, and she's like, you're going to be scared out scared out of your pants and I'm like no I'm not and then I went down there and it wasn't really that scary to me yes it is I don't scary. think it is <laughs> Ooh. um do you like haunted houses if so tell me the best one you've ever been to <laughs> see I ain't even done and she's sitting there going yeah. but um, but I love haunted houses um, when I was little, when we lived in Kentucky, my dad had some friends at work who had put together a haunted um, barn um, at his at one of his friends' houses, and oh my gosh, it was so fun! It was my favorite. It was one of my favorite things to do every Halloween. I would look forward to it. Um, you have you ever even been to a haunted house? Yes, I've been to haunted <laughs> houses when I was a kid. Number six. At what age did you finally stop I used to trick be or treating? Chicken. At what age did you finally stop trick or treating? She's making me stop this year. I don't get to, I don't get to. Did Jacob just walk across there in his underwear? Yes, he did. <laughs> and he ain't wearing no clothes. Well, yes, call him the street. <laughs> um, but I don't, I don't get to go trick or treating this year. Hey, hey, psh, psh, psh. hey, go tell her to, hey, kind of, um, somebody, come tell her to let me go trick or treating. Oh, Please. now you've done it. <laughs> um, speaking to um, Cree and Molly and all them, I, I know who you're talking to. <laughs> okay, what about you? What age did you? Daddy didn't stop trick or treating till he was 16 years old. 13. He said 16. We had an age. 13. There was an age limit when I was a kid. You couldn't go once you were 13. I've got friends who were going who were 16. Mm -hmm. What was your favorite costume? that you wore as a child. Mine was Pippi Longstocking. I had like the big old hair. <laughs> I had the big old <laughs> orange hair and all that. And you won an award. Yeah, I won, um, wasn't it like first? <coughs> yeah, you won first place. You won Best first costume. Place. Best costume. 
I'm what just about raggedy you? Ann. <laughs> you know, I found some pictures of her. I can't find them no more. I lost them. But there was a picture of um, my Uncle Chris was a clown and she was a cowgirl. Is that No, that, that was Raggedy was... Ann. That was you. Yeah, oh. That was Raggedy Ann. Well, see, see how good my memory is. <laughs> um, number eight. What was the strangest thing you ever got while trick-or-treating as a kid? One year, when we lived in Kentucky, half my bag was those little peppermints that you get at Sonic. <laughs> Everybody had saved up their Sonic All peppermints. The old people saved up their peppermints for Sonic. Yeah, they did, apparently. Because seriously, half my bag was Sonic peppermints. <laughs> what about you? I got a rock once. <laughs> you got a rock? I got a rock. Oh, do you know what? She has got a pet rock. Oh, let's not. No. <laughs> I got to show. No, 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 no. I got to go get the pet no, rock. Oh, move on. <laughs> I will come and take a picture of it and I'll put it in the video, okay? Promise. This lady in a garden, this lady that used to live next to her had this pet rock. Not a rock. She got a rock out of her um, garden and she painted a witch face on it or something. If you're going to tell it, you have to tell it right. I kept stealing rocks out of her garden. She had these real pretty little rocks that had little shiny look like diamonds to me and I kept stealing gar I kept stealing the rocks out of her garden so she finally gave me one and she told me that if that she put a magic spell on it and if I ever broke it that a bad bad witch would come out if as long as I didn't break it there would be a good witch inside and she would bring me good luck but if I ever broke the rock a bad witch would come out and do very bad things I'm 42 years old and I still have that rock <laughs> Oh, because she told me never to lose it either. Let's move on. They don't care about my <laughs> Yes, they do. <laughs> okay, um, have you ever done Halloween pranks on Dale's Night? No, but that sounds fun. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. No, I never did anything like that because I'm a good girl. <laughs> I know, Daddy had to have. Has he ever told you anything? No. no. Daddy never did anything. He was an angel, too, just like Mom. You did like a broken halo. <laughs> <laughs> okay, last question. It's getting ready to be over. <laughs> okay, um, <clears throat> when you were a kid, did you ever go trick or treating and end up at a house with no one home but a big bowl of candy? on the front porch that said take one. How many did you actually take? You answer this first. I'm, that never happened to me as a kid, but it did to you. Yeah, and she, I was trying to find, I was trick-or-treating with my brother one year, and there was a bowl on the porch, and there was like kids coming by saying that we got Krabby Patties from, have you, if you, anybody y'all know Spongebob, they have the little gummy Krabby Patties, and we couldn't find them on the top. And so I started digging down in there to find him one, and mommy started beeping the horn at me. <laughs> it's funny. Last year we went up um, up the street, and there were. And it said, "Nobody's home. Take a piece." And there was a big bowl sitting there with like fifty gazillion pieces of candy in there. Me and Jacob both started to take one each. Then all of a sudden, the door flew open, and this woman jumped out, fully dressed as a witch, and went, "Yeah!" Scared the crap out of Jacob. Oh, so that's why you should never try to take the whole bat, whole <laughs> bowl. You never know when somebody's watching you. I forgot about that. Yeah, they were standing there watching people. Yeah, and Jacob absolutely started crying, and she gave him almost the whole. She gave him half the bowl. <laughs> she did. She gave him half the bowl. We had the dots. She felt so bad because he cried. <laughs> she get you know those gummy dots. I don't really like them. She loves them. How but do you remember what you get at each house? <laughs> you better know. never give her bad candy because she'll remember you. <laughs> you know what's weird? I can remember just random things from when I was little. I remember um, Joey, our next door <laughs> neighbor. We're never going to get done. What's the next question? That's the last question. That was the last question? Yeah, number 10. That was our last question. Okay. Yeah, but um, our next door goodbye. neighbor. Wait, I'm not done with my story. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye. I was looking in the lab late. When my eyes beheld an eerie sight For my monster from his slab began to rise And suddenly, to my surprise He did the mash 
He did the monster mash. The monster 